Hi guys, welcome to another Tech Tuesday. Today I'm going to be sharing with you a technology tool for leaving comments and feedback on student works that absolutely blew my mind in this last week. So the technology cool tool is called Phrase Express. I'm going to go ahead and open it up so you can see what it looks like here. So Phrase Express allows you to create a comment bank of the comments that you use the most often when giving student feedback. And I know that I want to get better at leaving student feedback, but it always takes forever to type out the comments or even write out the comments. So Phrase Express allows you to create a shortcut for a comment that as soon as you write that shortcut, it will kind of bloom into this huge comment if you so wish. So for example, let me show you what it means. Over here in this list uh, for my Phrase Express list, I have all the comments that I use the most. So let's talk about acing the question that you didn't ace the question. So the description of it is going to be ace and then the phrase content is what I want my final comment to say. So normally I say something like, hey, you didn't ace this question. Here's what you need to do in order to ace it. And then I ask them a question so that they could correct it. Then what I need to do is put the auto text. This is my shortcut. You want to make it something uh, recognizable. So I always start mine with an asterisk. So you get to create whatever it is you want to put. So I just put an asterisk, that little star, and A-C-E for ace the question. And then I have this drop down menu that asks me when do I want this comment to appear where as soon as I type in ACE I want this to show up and I will save it in Phrase Express and so the next time I type asterisk ACE this response is going to pop up it's pretty awesome I have it for word length requirements I have it for an incorrect citation or no citation I want them to expand on your thoughts and different things like that so let me show you how this works when grading so I have a Google Doc. This does work in Schoology Google Docs as well as normal Schoology assignments. It works on anything that you type in, basically. So let's say I want to highlight something and comment on this. I'm going to add a comment. And let's say I talk, hey, you didn't ace the question on this. I'm simply going to type in my asterisk and then my shortcut A, C. And when I press E, that's the end of the command. All I need to do is press E and my comment pops up. So that just saved me a ton of time. Or let's talk about, hey, you didn't meet the word length requirement on this. I'm going to do an asterisk and then my shortcut for word length requirement, which is W, and then as soon as I hit L, there's that as well. So I could easily comment on it, saving me a ton of time. It even works on Schoology. Let's say I want to add a comment to the side here that you did um, an incorrect citation. So I'm going to do my shortcut, which is an asterisk, and then I C I see for incorrect citation there's my comment I can go ahead and post that comment and that literally took me less than a second now phrase express is awesome it works in email Google Docs Schoology Microsoft Word basically anything that you type in you do have to download it and you do have to have the administrative access to download it so I did have to email the help desk and ask them to allow me or download it for me onto my school device, which did take a while. Technically, you get 30 days free on the website for Phrase Express once you download it, and I'll put in the link to download it. And if you continue after the 30 days to use it for personal use, it continues to stay free. Now, I haven't gone past the 30 days yet, so if that ends up being not true, I apologize, but it's definitely worth it for the 30 days. And I think with, with regardless, uh, if you decide to purchase it, I think a one-time license is only $34. Because I have saved so much time already, that might even be something that I'm interested in purchasing to save myself some time when grading. So I'm going to leave the link to Phrase Express for you. And if that's something that you're interested in, you might want to ask the help desk to download it for you. Um, hopefully they don't get mad at me for suggesting that to you so they're not inundated with all of these requests. I hope you guys have a wonderful Tuesday. Thanks so much.